everyone's doing awesome this morning here. Um, I want to share a quick word of encouragement with you. I was reading this, this passage in 2 Corinthians 4, 8, and I really felt strongly in my spirit that some of you need to hear this word today, and it's going to encourage you, and this may be where you are. Um, in it, uh, it's the Apostle Paul here, and he says, We are pressed on every side by troubles, but we are not crushed. We are perplexed, but not driven into despair. We are hunted down, but never abandoned by God. We get knocked down, but we are not destroyed. Wow. Wow. Again, maybe that is where you feel that you are this morning. Um, all these things that are happening to you. You're pressed on every side of your troubles. You're perplexed. You're hunted down. You're knocked down. Um, in this passage, Paul reminds us that we may think that we are at the end of the rope, but we're, we're never at the end of our hope. Yes, our perishable bodies are subject to sin and suffering, but God never abandons us as believers. And yes, sometimes um, adv adversity seems to be our constant companion. And again, maybe that's where you are today. And it could cause us to begin to feel the trouble we are facing is never ending. And it's not easy to look past our current circumstances, to see the lasting benefits born in the midst of the incredible painful times that we are enduring. You know, we see instead shattered dreams, a broken trust, a lonely life, tears instead of laughter, and a future that does not look very bright at all. But if you could, to, if you could just for a moment take your eyes off your situation, instead look through the eyes of hope to see that in, mid, in the midst of all of this, God is performing some of His best work ever. You can find comfort as His hands embrace you and begin to truly discover true joy and peace in the center of this mess that you may be in. You will see that the pain and the heartbreak do not serve to destroy you, but to strengthen your faith, build great character, and cause you to become firmly rooted. There is not one of us that has the, all the answers, guys. But we can certainly trust the one who does by placing complete trust in God today. We don't see and understand the whys, guys. I know we don't. None of us do. But today, I, let me encourage you to choose to trust that He is in control, even in the smallest detail, and that we remain safe in His loving care and His hands. Well, guys, I just felt very strongly in my spirit that some of you really need to hear that word of encouragement, that you are going through a very difficult time. I hope it does encourage you and minister to your heart. Um, please share this message because I guarantee there's others that could be, that could be um, ministered to and encouraged by this word. I hope you guys have an awesome day. I know that I love you guys and I'm praying for you.